All right, so letting 11, 83 plus times 10 packs choose our foot champions team. Are you facing ridiculous teams and you're stuck with ones just like this? Well, look no further. Head over to u 7 buycom and get yourself some foot coins using the code NERDFIRE at the checkout for 5% off your order. It'll be linked in the description. They are cheap, safe, and the most reliable. So make sure you go ahead and check them out and make your team better than ever. Okay, boys, so today we are back with a brand new video. And as you can tell by the title today, we are here with another challenge video, as you can probably tell. I don't know why I've said that about 15 times. But yeah, like I said in the intro, you can probably see by the title and also the thumbnail. We are today letting 11 of the 83 plus times 10 SBC packs choose our foot champions team. So if you didn't see the other day, EA dropped these packs. I actually did a video on them if you want to see even more of these packs that you're going to see in this video. Basically today you're going to see 10 brand new ones and one from that previous video basically because I didn't have enough. So I needed to steal just one and then the other 10 are fresh brand new ones as well. And before we get into it, like I always say, make sure you guys let me know in the comments the next challenge you would like to see. Like any of the ones you see below as well. And the most liked one I will try and do as a challenge video next as a letting 11 something. Let me know the ideas in the comments below. But anyways, back onto it. If you don't know how this works, for this one, for the 83 plus times 10, obviously there's 10 players you get per pack. So from each 83 plus times 10 pack we open out of the 11, we get to choose two players to put into a squad. You see the players that we choose at the end, they'll all go to a squad on FIFA. And then we use the players to then build a team and then play a game of foot champions and hopefully win. That would be uh, nice. I'd like to get a win. That would be good. So yeah, if you guys enjoy it, smash the like button. If you don't really understand it as well, hopefully you kind of understand it a bit more the longer it goes on. Basically, we're going to see the packs first. Then from them packs, the players will be put into the squad. Then we'll figure out the team, play a game, and that's how we'll go. So let's get into it. All right, here we go. My 83 plus times 10 pack. <sighs> oh, God, I swear, if there's not a walkout here, then wow. Hands will be thrown. All right, so walkout's not for birthday, though. A bit disappointing. Not going to lie. Spanish. David De Gea. Oh, it's only going to be... It's going to be a one walkout pack. I don't know if I'll get another 86 here. I don't think I'm going to get another 86, am I? I don't think I'm going to get another 86. Surprise me. Wow. That is a harsh pack. All right, here we go. The 83 plus times 10 pack. Number two for foot birthday. Come on. Walk out. It's not a foot birthday. We, well, that's pretty obvious. Oh, my God. Is that Modric? Interesting. Is he 87? Could still have another walkout behind him. When you see 86, I just have no hope. But maybe two walkout pack? Maybe? No. It's not. It's really not, is it? Okay. Okay. All right. Come on, then. 83 plus times 10. Foot birthday, please. Come on. I think that's just a normal goal, isn't it? Brazil. Center forward. Pele. No, it's Firmino. Is that 87? There could still be a walk up behind him. Nope. Nowhere near. Nowhere near a walk up behind him. Brilliant. All right. Nice. All right. Shout out to the man. Oh, Twitch. He's got a lot of packs saved, I believe, as well. But the one we are looking for is the 83 plus times 10. Foot birthday, please. Please. Just show us any of the foot I don't. I just want to see it. I, I don't even know what it looks like to pack one. All right. That's what I want to see. Ha. We don't get one. It's an inform, though. Is that uh, Kalanoglu? 85? I think he's in for this. 84. Oh, God. All right. Well, hopefully there's an 86 behind him. Hopefully there's an 86 behind him. Maybe. No, but he's got two informs that are 84s. So technically two walkouts and Rashford. All right. Mr. Thiago Reyes, 83 times 10. <laughs> Foot birthday time. Lucas, Inaki Williams, someone like that. Walkout. Not a foot birthday. It's a normal gold. Maybe one day. Oh. Is that? Oh, Lewandowski. All right. I couldn't tell what position it was because obviously it's a different uh, language. But highest rated one we've seen today, um, which is decent. Anyone good behind him? He got a two walkout pack, I guess. Not too bad. Not too bad. All right. Can this be the time? We get a foot birthday. Number six of the day. Come on. I just want to see the flare, man. I just want to see the... F That's not even a walkout. That's the first non-walkout one I've seen. I kid you not. That is the first non-walkout. Is that 84 or 85? I think that's 85, isn't it? Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Wow. I have no words. I have no words. All right, here we go. 83 plus times 10, number like eight of today. No, seven. Sorry, not eight, seven of the day. Come on. Walk out. Still yet to see a foot birthday. Germany. CDM. Oh, Kimmich. Okay. 
The wrong German Bayern Munich player, I'm not gonna lie. We wanna see Sane! Change the D to the A, and Sane, yeah, okay. Uh, Kimmich, Ziyech, one walkout. Mate, you don't get many walkouts in these packs at all, do you? Damn. Mr. B Sinner, number eight of the day. These 83 pluses still yet to somehow, we haven't seen a single foot birthday. EA, come on, be kind to someone. Be kind to someone. Walkout, not a foot birthday. Still don't know what the color of the tunnel is or etc. Brazil. Goalkeeper, which one? Oh, Allison. High rated. Can we see a two? Can we see a three walkout pack? And they're like so rare in these for some reason. I don't think I've actually seen a three walkout pack. What's it going to be? Oh, Bamyang in there. Joe Gomez. Ah, it's not bad, actually. Not bad. Two decently high rated walkouts, I guess. All right. Kieran, here we go. He's got an ultimate pack and the 83 times 10. Go for it, brother. Number two for the video. Nope, it's not going to walk, uh, walk out yet. Yeah, I agree with you, Riggers, mate. I actually agree with you. I feel like the team would have been alright, but considering it got leaked, people just kind of been like a, sitting there like, what? 84 on the ultimate, Jesus. 10 83 plus. Still yet to see a foot birthday. Could this be the pack where we see one? Come on, EA. No, we don't. It's a normal gold. Who's it going to be? Poland? Str oh, Lewandowski! Okay, that's high rated. Can we see a fair few walkouts in this? That's what I want to see. That would be nice. That would be nice, all right? So, let's skip and see who's behind Lewandowski. Anyone good behind him? Sancho Walker Marti. Oh, that's a decent pack. That's not bad at all. That is not bad at all. All right, I think he's going to open it now. Here we go. All right, pack four. Come on. Look at Ronaldo, Mbappe, Neymar. Show us one of them ballers right now. That'd be sick. Walkout. Not an inform, I don't think. I believe it's not. Which one? Kulabali. Ah, oh, could have been Mane. Could have been Mane, but that's the highest rated, I believe, so far. 88? I might be wrong. How many walkouts? Two walkouts, but two higher rated walkouts than the other ones. A lot fodder in there as well. 85, 84s. All right, so there were all of the 11 packs. So, like I said, I've gone ahead and put all the players into a squad. Let me run back. Let me run you back through them now, and let's see who we've got. Okay, so from pack one, we took De Gea and Navas. Pack two, we put Digne and Allen. Pack three, we took Firmino and Donny van der Beek. Pack four, we took Rashford and Isco. Pack five, we took Dembele and Henderson. Pack six was Parejo and Ndidi. Pack seven, was Ziyech and Kovacic. Pack 8 was Gomez and Aubameyang. Pack 9 was Bergwijn and Oyarzabal. Pack 10 was Walker and Sancho. And pack 11 was Laporte and Thiago. They are the players we have at our disposal for this team. Sadly, we didn't get a single foot birthday, which was quite upsetting. I'm not going to lie. I don't know how we didn't get a, a single one from opening 10 when literally foot birthday was out. But you know, it is what it is. But now it's time to actually figure out the team we're going to use. So let's get back over to FIFA and let's see what we can come up with. All right, here we go. What formation are we going to rock, though, is the question. A 4-3-3, a 4-3-3-4, uh, 4 one might be a shout. I don't know. I mean, the only right wing we have, actually, is Sancho. I've just realized that. So that is a little bit interesting here. We're going to have to figure out how this works. Let's go from the back anyways. Let's just get a back four sorted. So obviously, we have one left back. We have, I think, two right backs and one centre back. So the only way we're really going to be able to do this is like this. We have Carl Walker at centre back and Joe Gomez alongside him. I mean, it's not bad, really. Is it Walker's going to be good at centre back, realistically? Then I think best option, right centre mid, would be Thiago because he links to both Joe Gomez and then gets a link to um, Navas as well. Uh, left forward, obviously, we'd put Rashi in, maybe Henderson central. And our other centre mid can be any Premier League centre mid we want. And I might go either Ziyech or Allen. I think I might go Allen. I don't know. He was really good at the start of the game. I don't know if he's any good now. Uh, Striker-wise, we have a Bamiang. Do we have any other strikers as well? I don't think we do. Actually, wait, we have Laporte. I just realized a back four is fine. We can, we can go Laporte at center back and then bring Kyle Walker at right back. And our chemistry is, all of a sudden, a lot better. That's what we like to see. That means then we don't have to use Thiago if we don't want to. So I might take Thiago out and bring in, like, Kovacic instead, maybe. I don't know. I mean, Jaden Sancho, who is he going to link to? Literally, Henderson, and that is about it. And then Aubameyang going striker, maybe? Yeah, the chemistry there is not great. Wait, if he went to the 4 3 3, Sancho would be on a bit better chemistry. I mean, it doesn't really change Aubameyang's. Actually, does it even make a difference? I don't think it does. What am I on about? I don't know. However, we could actually do this, where we could start Firmino at striker, Alan at Cam. That would obviously give a strong link to Firmino, and then switch Alan and Ziyech in game or something. But do I rather start with Aubameyang or just bring Aubameyang off from the bench? Maybe, maybe that's the play. 
I don't know. Ah, uh, it's a hard one. Yeah, I think we might do that, actually. I think we'll go with that. So, let's go back through the team again. So, in goal, we do have De Gea. Right back is Walker. Right centre back is Gomez. Left centre back is Laporte. Left back is Digne. Left centre mid is Ziyech. Central cam is Allen. Right centre mid is Henderson. Then we've got right wing Sancho. Striker Firmino. And left wing is Rashford. All right, it's going to be interesting. Obviously, we've got to go ahead and select three subs. So, let me go and figure out who I want my three subs to be now. So the three subs on the side is going with was Usman Dembele, Navas, and Kovacic. I know I said I was going to put Aubameyang on the bench, but now thinking about it, I could actually just switch Rashford up front in game and then bring Dembele on the left wing or something like that. And I want Navas in there because I don't know what Laporte's going to be like at centre back. So we might switch him for Walker in game, bring Navas on, put him at right back as well. And then Kovacic is a good all round kind of centre midfielder, so he could definitely do a job in the midfield as well. So yeah, there we go. That is our completed team from the 83 times 10. So obviously what I'll do now is I'll go ahead and buy the team, and then when I buy it, I'll show you. You guys the team one more time then we'll get ourselves into a game and see what we could do in foot champions okay so as you can see the team has now been bought there it is in its flesh all right let's get ourselves into a champs game with this team and let's see what he can do okay so here is our opponent's team and it's not a bad one at all inform car walker at center back inform rashford ronaldo neymar marquinhos bruno player of the month tavernier headliner Prime Zanetti, Pope. He's got so many good players in this team, like ridiculously good. It's going to be a hard challenge, but let's see what our 83 plus times 10 team could do. Come on. All right, let's go. We have changed to attacking, so uh, ZH can now go cam. That is the play. Oh, Alan's still up here. Firmino, though. Firmino. Oh, it's the AI block and a half. Nice, Henderson. Here we go. Firmino, this is where we're going to lack of the pace. This is why I'm not the most excited using uh, Firmino, though. But here we go, ZH. Ah, oh, this guy's rocking a five back as well, which is not fun at all. Sancho. Oh, Sancho. Oh, it's a corner. Oh, heavy touch. He's still got it though, Sancho. Cut inside. Oh, that's a corner. We'll take it. Ah, oh, no. Rashford's got loads of space here. David De Gea. Let's go, De Gea. Ah, Neymar scored. Oh, mate, honestly, I can't wait to get to halftime. I'm going to take Firmino off 100%. It's just not quick enough to be up top, but 1-0 now to this guy. Nice finish. Oh, no. What the hell's going on? Lock on EA. Really? Good save again. Good ball roll. Rashford. Oh, he's been fouled, referee. Into Rashford. Through the legs. Oh, I've been fouled again. That is a foul, man. Oh, my God. Literally the most painful game. This guy playing five at the back with his team against mine. Like, it's just, it's just not possible. Well, there we go, then. The most boring game I have ever played probably in a while. The guy decided to play five back and just absolutely sit back against a goal team like I had. There's not much I could do. He had informed Kyle Walker. Like, literally had informed Kyle Walker. He had Freeze Marquinhos all just sitting back the whole game. It was so boring. That's all I'm going to say. That's why there was probably about three highlights. So, yeah, that wraps up the game. It kind of killed my mood. I'm not going to lie. Like, it was literally just stupid. Like, I was playing Gold Rashford against all these ridiculously good defenders. In a five back as well. I had, like, one shot the whole game because I literally couldn't actually get a shot because all of his defenders were AI blocking for him. So it just wasn't fun. But hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Nevertheless, it would have been nice if we had a bit of a better team to try and challenge against a five back. But hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Like I said earlier, make sure you let me know in the comments below the next challenge you guys would like to see. But yeah, guys, anyways, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you did enjoy the video. And I hope to see you guys next time. Goodbye. <laughs>